Let's talk a little bit about variants, lineages, and strains. SARS-CoV-2, like many other viruses, has been accumulating mutations and evolving over time. This is just part of the natural phenomenon that all viruses are subject to, and SARS-CoV-2 has been tracked by the scientific community ever since we were first able to sequence it in early 2020 to track what types of mutations and evolution is happening for this virus. A variant is a specific position change between the original SARS-CoV-2 genome and the genome of the sample that's in front of you. A variant refers to a specific location and a specific change that has occurred. They're often called mutations. Not all variants result in any change in the properties of the virus itself. And in fact, most variants are considered benign, meaning that they have no effect on the way that the virus actually behaves. A lineage is a collection of variants that help to define a specific line of that virus. This collection of variants then, when they are seen within a sample, can be used to classify the sample as belonging to that lineage or that line. A strain is a lineage that has actually accumulated or acquired different or new properties of the virus compared to the original virus. In the case of SARS-CoV-2, these properties include transmissibility, infectivity, pathogenicity, and the ability of vaccines to recognize the virus. Let's take an example. You've probably heard of the strain called B117. This is a strain that was originally identified within the UK and it's colloquially known as the UK strain. This strain actually has a total of 23 variants in it that differ between the original SARS-CoV-2 genome and the genome of B117. Not all of these 23 changes result in a change in the properties of the virus but it is this collection of these 23 changes that actually helps define the B117 lineage. It means then when you have a sample in front of you that you've sequenced, when you're able to see that these 23 changes have occurred, that's when you're able to classify the sample as belonging to B117. B117 is also known to be more transmissible than other versions of SARS-CoV-2. And this is the change in the property of the virus that has resulted in B117 being classified as a strain. Because B117 is more transmissible, it has a different property compared to the original SARS-CoV-2 virus, and that's why we call it the B117 strain. So a variant is a single point change between the original SARS-CoV-2 virus and the sample that's in front of you. A lineage is a collection of variants that help to define a specific line of SARS-CoV-2. And a strain is a lineage that has acquired new or different properties of the virus compared to the original virus.